And then he said, now I've laid my trust in Allah. عَلَيْهِ تَوَكَّلْتُ وَعَلَيْهِ فَلْيَتَوَكَّلِ الْمُتَوَكِّلُونَ And he says, indeed those who are the layers of trust should lay their trust only in him, in Allah. You want to lay your trust in someone, it should only be Allah. Ultimate trust is laid in Allah. We do know that if a little child looks at the parent, a little uh, person looks at someone bigger, uh, a person who's working for you looks at you as a boss or as a, when I say as a boss, I mean as someone who's slightly above them in authority or in wealth or whatever else. They say, look, I trust you and I know this. What they mean is, I only trust you within the limits that Allah has given you. Beyond that, it's Allah whom I ultimately trust for me and for you. Subhanallah. So Allah gives everyone a little capacity. If you take a look at Yusuf alayhi salam's story, it's amazing because right at the beginning, he tells his son, don't even narrate this dream to the others. Why? That's part of taking precautions. So